a large hypocagenic nodule occupies almost the entire right lobe. In such large nodules which fill almost an entire lobe, abutting is almost inevitable. Nevertheless, in this case, abutment is found only in the ventral and medial part of the lobe, because there is a thin rim around most of the nodule. The capsule of the thyroid is almost never continuous in such large goiters, whether benign or malignant. The borders are blurred, partly because of technical reason, the transducer cannot be fit properly all along the neck of the patient. The lesion presents signs of paranodular blood flow. Finally, a U.S. guided aspiration is demonstrated at higher magnification.